Hello Libra and welcome to Lotus Spirit Tarot. My name is Shannon Colleen and this is going to be a timeless reading for you. I'm just going to see what spirit has for you Libra. Before we get started I do want to mention that yes I am available for private readings at this time so if you want to hear directly from your angels guides and ancestors go ahead and click on the link in the description box below that will take you to my booking site. Uh, and when you get there, hit book now, and we'll show you all the different readings and Reiki that I offer. So feel free to book that while there's openings. Whew, all right. Divine Source Creator, what is the overall energy for Libra, please? What is the overall energy for Libra? Show us clearly for Libra. Whoa. All right, Libra. <laughs> Not wasting any time. Oh, Libra, I love this. I love this talent card. Uh, it is time to let your talent shine. We all have talents. We all have massive talents. And the divine is saying you're ready to put yours out there. Now, you could be just like this card, right? You could be a dancer and you're going to be in that field and you're going to be on Broadway or you know whatever it might be. But it can be a talent in uh, your natural gifts. Some people are really talented with numbers. So maybe you choose to go into a career that supports that. But whatever this is, because it is a general reading, it is the divine saying, put your talents out there. Okay? Some of you might be starting a new platform, showing off your talents, um, you know, through a YouTube channel, whatever it may be. But you have something to offer. Okay, you have something to offer and you need to share it with the world. N now is not the time to hold back. Now is the time to go for it. Um, and you don't have to have everything in order, Libra. I know that you like to have things in order, but you don't have to. So it's like when you try to be overly prepared. A lot of people, when they try to open a business or a YouTube channel, they want like the best camera ever and the best microphone. No, that's what holds you back. You just go do. Show your talents. Your talents are going to shine regardless of equipment or this, that, or the other, whatever it is, right? But it is time for you to put that forth. I think you are handsomely rewarded in many ways. Uh, could be in, you know, monetary gains, money. Um, it can be the award, right? The trophy, if you will. It can be love. When you're showing your true self and your talents, you attract, and people who are attracted to that are going to come in and just absolutely want to offer you love so whatever this is please do not hold back libra do not hold back you're doing a disservice to yourself and to the world when you hold back your talents all right let's see what we have in the tarot let's see what we have in the tarot um don't forget to check your other placements to your rising your moon your venus so if you're a Pisces rising, make sure that you check that out. Sorry, this is one of my favorite decks I've had for a hundred years, and it's like really getting worn and torn at this point. Uh, so shuffling it is goofy. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles, get moving, okay? You do not want to be slow. This is the slowest night in the deck, and Spirit is telling you, your angels, guides, and ancestors are telling you, Libra, Let's not sit. It's not time to be the Knight of Pentacles. It's time to get moving on this. Okay? You need to get moving. That's all I keep hearing. Get moving, get moving, get moving. No more sitting and practicing. It would be like a, you know, someone who is, plays, you know, an instrument who's just like, well, I got to practice more. I got to practice more. I got no. It's time to move. Okay? It's time to move. This is the direction you're supposed to go in. Show me clearly, please. Whoa. Oh my gosh, yes. Look at the Empress. Okay, this is going to bring you abundance in some form. Okay, this is... It's often like with the Empress, I explain her as a gardener, right? She goes and she plants seeds and she nurtures and waters them and she takes care of them and she's an expert at doing that. You are an expert at this, whether you think so or not. Uh, I don't know who this is for. This is not going to be for all of you, but somebody is a, at an amateur level and you need to go pro. It's like time to go pro, okay? So whatever or whomever that is for, <laughs> it's time to go pro, 
<laughs> okay. Ah. Uh, show me clearly for Libra, please. What is the message? Thank you. All right. So we have, yes, see, nine of cups and the empress. Are you kidding me? I mean, those are abundant cards. Those are, I'm emotionally fulfilled. I have food on the table. I've got money coming in. I've got all my needs met. So it truly, truly is time to get off your behind. <laughs> okay, get off your behind. We love the Nine of Pentacles in certain readings, but in this reading, it's more of spirit saying, come on, you know, let's go. Your wish fulfillment is there. All right, let's see what else we have for Libra. No more wasting time. No more procrastinating. No more giving reasons. No more fear, right? You're going to be successful in this. Show me clearly. Thank you. So I almost dropped half the deck. All right, so we have here, yes, would you please, 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 Libra, I'm begging you. Intuitively, you know you need to go this direction. You need to show those talents. You need to put it out there. Yes, we have fear of being judged. Yes, we have fear of something not being successful. Of course we do. But this is about facing that fear. Because the Nine of Pentacles, and my longtime viewers know, Libra, is my favorite card in the deck. It is where you stand out. It is confidence. It's a card of confidence. And I'm standing out. Look at me shine. And it brings you some sort of material success here. And, right, we got the Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups and emotional fulfillment. So it's time to make the decision. Twos are about making decisions. It's time to make the decision, which you intuitively know that you need to do this, that it's your calling, that it's something you need to put out there. So, honestly, Libra, I'm telling you... <laughs> Get out of your head and follow your intuition because spirit is pushing and pushing and pushing for you to put this out there. Whatever it is. Okay. They are saying you are going to be a standout. You are going to be a standout in this. You are going to be successful at this. You have all the training you need. You have all the resources you need right at this moment to get started. Oh, I love that. Show me clearly, please. What is the message for Libra? That's too many. Can I just have one or two, please? Thank you. Yeah. See, Spirit is guiding you to this. It's like they're saying, get in the boat. Let's go to the Paradise Island. Because for me, it's like your paradise, whatever your paradise island would be. And they're like, you're like, oh, but I don't know. I don't trust the boat. Trust the boat. <laughs> Spirit is like, this is your calling. This is where you need to go. This is what's going to bring you joy and happiness. The good news is, Libra, I think you listen to Spirit. I think you absolutely listen to Spirit and you get in the boat. Okay? Maybe you just needed... Excuse me. Let me take a sip of this here. Maybe you just needed that this little push, this reading, to push you. for To say, Spirit's going, I've got you, right? This is good let's go this direction this is very very good oh yeah you gotta stop hiding it from the world i don't know what it is for each and every one of you but there is a talent that you need to stop hiding it needs to be illuminated it is going to be beneficial not only for you but for others okay this is like two cards of not following your intuition intuitively your heart knows I need to put this out there, whatever it is. Okay? It's ready. Take it out of the oven. It's ready. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Let's see what else we have for you. Libra, Libra, Libra. What do we have for Libra, please? Angels, guides, ancestors for Libra. What is the message, please? Yeah, I love this. Love. Live your truth and share the love that is in your soul. Share your love of this talent. Go out there and do. You will receive so much good back. You'll receive love back, applause back, award, money. You're going to receive it back. So you need to put it out there. Okay? Don't be afraid. 
Or even if you are afraid, face it anyway. Go do it anyway. I just, you have something very big to offer. And you need to, it's a soul path that you need to take. Oh, Libra, Libra, Libra. <laughs> all right, Libra, with that being said, all of my love, light, and blessings to you. Until next time.